A very warm welcome to your own channel Astrologer. In this video we are going to know about the dates of Pitrapaksha in 2022 and what we can do to make our life successful, how to attract the blessings of ancestors. Pitrapaksha is the time of ancestors. It is the time when we can perform rituals to overcome from the different types of doshas in our birth chart or horoscope. Pitrapaksh or Mahalaya is the time when we can do something for our ancestors, betterment. This is the time when one can get the blessings of ancestors easily. In the year 2022, Pitrapaksh will start from 11th of September, Sunday and remain till 25th of September, Sunday. These 16 days of Pitrapaksha are very special because in these days we perform special prayers, rituals for the upliftment of ancestors and to attract their blessings to make our life successful. It is said that in these days our ancestors come in our home to get something which is offered by us. So if anyone want to give something to the ancestors, Pitrapaksha is the right time to do so. Every sense and yogis also wait for this time. No one in the universe is deprived of the ancestor's blessings in his or her life. Ancestors help us to get success in life. Because of them we are present. Our existence is because of them. So it is our duty to do something for our ancestors. It is said that in our epics that our rituals helps them to go up. We can help our ancestors for their upliftment. Now let's know about a special process known as Tarpan to live successful life. As per our holy books, Tarpanam is the most easy way to make our ancestors happy and to get the blessings of ancestors. And if Tarpanam is done in the special time of Mahalaya or Pitrapaksh, then no one can stop us to get success in life. Pitrapaksh is very important period when we can do the Pitra Puja not only for our growth but for our ancestors' uplift, upliftment too. Our karmas, anushthans, puja, rituals on these days not only give happiness to our ancestors or pitra but also make our life better and hurdle free. Two types of problems can be eradicated in this Mahalaya. The problems of our ancestors due to which they are not getting success in their world. The problem of us due to which we are not getting success in our world. Many types of Shanti Pujas are done on Pitrapaksh such as Kal Sab Shanti Puja, Pitra Dosh Shanti Puja, Pred Dosh Shanti Puja, Evil Eye Effect Shanti Puja, Black Magic Removal Puja, Rog Mukti Puja, Rahu Shanti Puja etc. Now let's know what to do on Pitrapaksh days or in Mahalaya. In Pitrapaksh, don't forget to donate a part from your daily lunch and dinner. You can give this part to crow, cows, dog. Even you can donate food to needy beggars. If, you, if your pocket permits, then do donate clothes in the name of your ancestors to needy persons. If you know Tarpan process, then you must do Tarpan in all days of Shraddhapaksh to get the blessings of your ancestors. Pitrapaksh is very important to remove the Pitra Dosha if present in our horoscope or Kundli. For this, you can hire Brahmins or Vedic astrologers. If you recite the Bhagavad Gita lessons daily for your ancestors, then this is also a very good way to please our ancestors. Daily pray to your ancestors to come at your home and accept your offerings and bless you to get success in life. Dhoop of saffron in the southwest corner in the name of ancestor is also a very good way to get the blessings of ancestors. 
take blessings of our elders daily in the morning in pitrupaks do donate in old age home in shraddhapaks this will also give you a very good result rituals in shraddhapaks helps to minimize the effects of pitrudosha from life helps to reduce the impact of kal sarp dosha in birth chart helps to resolve marriage problems helps to remove hurdles in studies attract health wealth and prosperity so be active and do something for your upliftment for your ancestors upliftment in the pitrupaksh or mahalaya hope you have got information regarding pitrupaksh in the year 2022 If you want to read the detailed article you can check the description box if you are new in this channel don't forget to subscribe so as to get the latest updates as soon as it is published let's meet in another video till then om namah shivaya